five essential pentatonic repeating licks rock blues style to learn coming up in just a second if you do like the video please do consider liking sharing subscribing hitting the bell button and visiting the patreon and website for your tabs for this lesson that is it let's get on with those licks Starts with the bend, seventh fret, full tone bend on that third uh, string. So you got, and then you got fifth fret, second, fifth fret, first. Try and roll your finger across, and then eighth fret, second string to pull off to the five. So, and then you repeat that round. So with all of, the, of these licks, you try and do them at a speed which suits you. Uh, so don't jump in like a bull in a china shop and get it wrong or messy and just unfluent. Wrong word, but you know what I mean. So. Okay, so you can come out of these tail off from them uh, however you want, but picking wise. All indicated on the tab anyway, which you can see. Um, which is on my website, by the way. Go and visit it. So, in theory, this is a simple lick, but it's so hard to get right and keep it going at that kind of uh, velocity that you need. You know, once you get it, it sounds great, but again, don't try and rush into it, keep it slow, keep it even, and it will work well. Um, so you've got five on the first string, eight pull off to five second string. It's up to you what fingers you would use. Gary Moore would probably use the second finger, going to the first finger. For some reason I use my little finger. Keeps it nice and even for me, and less of a stretch, but you know, all each to their own, so. And then it's the seventh fret on that third string. So, so picking wise, you've got um, up, down, down. It kind of almost looks like I'm doing an upstroke for that five, but I'm actually pulling off from the eight. Anyway, there we go. Lick three coming up. So this one is that on a repeat. So we've got again seventh fret bends, third string, and then five on the second, five on the first, five on the second again. Try and roll that finger across to each, and then a pull off from eight to five. So, so that's going to be down, down, up, and then down. find a picking pattern which suits you better as well so each to their own here we go so this one This one's quite hard to repeat, so which is why I end up uh, sort of going to that A note, the root note, and just holding it for I don't know a beat before I go back into it. Especially at this speed. If you were at a lower speed or a slower speed, you could probably find a way of repeating it easily. But anyway, the idea is that we've got a pattern which reoccurs of four notes, and then you come down another four notes, and then down another four notes to finish. So it's a pull off from the 8 to the 5, and then pick in the 8 to the 5 second string. And I'll probably do down, up, down. Um, and then you've got 5 on the first string for the next set of 4, which is 5, 8, 5 pull off, and then 7 on that third string. And then you've got 8, 5 pull off second string, 7, 5 on the third string. And then the last set of four, which is five on the second string, seven five pull off on the third string. 
string and seven on that D string, the fourth string to uh, execute and finish. We'll repeat from. Right, and the last lick goes. So this one, basically you've got the eight pull off to the five. Seems to be a reoccurring theme with this one, right? And then the seven on the third string, and then five on that second string. So, so it's gonna be down, pull off, down, So again, it's like where I'm pulling off, I'm doing a virtual up pick. So just to keep the fluency with your picking hand going, which makes it easier to get speed on these. You could use hybrid picking. But that again is another thing to learn if you don't already know it. So with that in mind, that is your lesson done. Have fun with these. Thanks for making it this far. Um, if you did like this video, once again, please do consider sharing it with all your friends on social media, liking and hitting that bell button, subscribing to the channel, visiting the Patreon page, the website for the tab, it's all free on there. And um, the super thanks button if you do decide that you like it that much, you want to say super thanks, as it were. Um, yeah, cool, right. No much more to say really apart from i bid you farewell and i'll see you next time for another lick lesson of some sort see you later